girls love the same man. Oh, the nice girls love the tar. Oh, the nice girls love I've got even Marlene like sailors. Yeah, she does. In any case, there are other girls besides Marlene. There's the temple girls of Bangkok, the dancing girls of Hong Kong, the Hores of the Mystic East. There are Melanesians, Polynesians, single Asians, round, cuddly girls, tall, slender girls, hot, passionate girls, <clears throat> cold, statuesque girls. There's blondes, brunettes, redheads, girls without any hair at all. You tell me some more, more. <laughs> Down to Heaty Way, the hula hula girls only wear grass skirts. Nothing else. What do you mean? They haven't got the. 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 They haven't Really? Yeah. <laughs> ah! Perhaps we better get her back here. That's it. Absolutely preposterous. Does your ministry seriously suggest that a space rocket can only be piloted by a scientist? Precisely. Such a project can only be undertaken by a man of the highest possible intellect. Meaning Mr. Carruthers? And why not? Well, I disagree. What we want in the cockpit of Boson. Boson, <laughs> quiet, please. Boson, quiet, please. Really, Admiral, I fail to understand why an animal should be invited to a conference such as this. Oh, damn it, man, the rocket is named after him. Well, as I was saying, what we need in the cockpit is brawn and not brains. A simple-hearted sailor with initiative and guts. A, a man with Nelson's blood in his veins. <laughs> <laughs> I could have fallen in the water then. You. Take that smile off your face. Oh, oh, oh. You don't recognize me, do you? Fall in. What about uh, all the girls with the grass skirts on? Some of them haven't got nothing on the top. <laughs> Join the other recruits. What's up with him? Get fell in. Well, this is all very serious, isn't it? Right, you will note the decks of Her Majesty's ships are kept spotlessly clean. The same applies to everything. Brass, paint, woodwork, and every single man who sails in her. Yeah. Well, I must say, you've got a very, very nice boat here. Ship. Ship done in the Navy. Yes, sir. Aye, aye, sir. Aye, aye, sir. Right, we will now proceed below. We going downstairs? In the Navy below. Understand? Yeah. Uh, sir. Uh, aye, aye, sir. Right. Follow me. Come on, then.
you the new boy? Yes. I used to work at Dalton's. Oh, you're not Norman Puckle. <laughs> I am, you know. Haven't you got on? Oh. <laughs> Here, I've got something for you. From a Miss Barlow? No, Marlene. Thought so. Chuck it up. Oh, it might fall in the water. All right, then, I'll, I'll come down. I don't make statements that I can't justify. I can and will take the newest recruit. And... What the hell do you think you're doing? Hello? Get away from here. This is a private conference. I'll tell you what you're talking about. This man's mad. It's a bloke going crackers in here. <laughs> Get back on deck. Oh, this is intolerable. Get that man removed at once. Yes, sir. Man overboard. Better hurry back, sir. The boarding ladder's the other side. Oh, anything wrong, sir? She's getting married. Here we are, sir. Man overboard! Man overboard! Where? Port side. Well, which is port side? <laughs> Get that knife for port side, Torrin! Man overboard! Did you hear? There's a man overboard! Well, stand by to go over yourself! Come on, move yourself! Will not be! Yes, if we spot him! Coxon, get that boat full quarter. Aye, aye, sir. You've got to be no soon, eh? Well, get it off, quick! Never mind about that. Look. Look. There's a shadow down there. It might be him. Over you go. Come on! Well, what are you waiting for? I can't swim. Yeah. Oh, now you tell me. Come on, back in time. Hold this. Oh. I can manage, thank you. Wait a minute, Chief. Better muster more men from below. Yeah, but I... I know you want to go in yourself.